What's up guys, this is iTweaks here with iPhoneHacks.com and today I'm going to be showing you how to identify battery hogs in iOS 8 to go ahead and extend your iPhone's battery life. So a new feature that has been added to iOS 8 is the ability to see how much battery usage that you're getting from each application. So you can see right here if we just jump to the settings and then jump into general, we're going to scroll down here to usage, open that up and then tap on battery usage. So you can see right here that it's going to give you the battery usage breakdown for the last 24 hours or seven days as you can see right here. So you can see most of my time is spent on the home or lock screen. Then I have mail, photos, settings, Skype, and you can see how much battery usage this is actually taking up. So if you see an outlier like you're having, you know, background refresh on your mail and it's taking up, you know, 40% of your battery, then maybe that's something that you want to reconsider and turn off background uh, app refresh. So there's a few things that you can do in order to save battery life after taking a look at these applications. Now if we go back here and we go into privacy, you can turn off the location services for specific applications and that's going to save battery life. So if we tap on location services, you can see right here that we have only three or actually two uh, applications that are using my location services. So if we wanted to turn that off, you can see we can tap on that and then tap never and then that's not going to allow weather to access my location. Now that's not necessarily one of the applications you want to turn off, but this is just an example of what you can do uh, with the location services. Now again, like I said, turning off background app refresh, you can also do that by going here into general again, and we're going to scroll down to background app refresh, and then you can see all the toggles right here. So you can turn these off individually, or you can just turn off the entire thing. So that's going to turn it off for all. So if we toggle that back on, all of these are going to toggle back on. So just a quick tip to let you guys know how to save more battery on your new iDevice. So let me know what you guys think about it in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. If you want to see more of my videos, then go ahead and subscribe. All right, guys, until next time, this is iTweaks with iPhoneHacks.com.